Welcome to XPGIN, humanity's official Imperial news source. My name's Captain Shaq. Tonight's top stories. XPGIN exclusive. The Crusaders, for the first time, have been caught on sensors fighting. A massive Crusader fleet was captured by the Imperial Recon Group while assaulting a Republic position in the Sabulia system. From the footage, Imperial weapons experts have identified a number of different offensive and defensive capabilities, from energy-based point defense that seems to stop effortlessly incoming warheads, to long-range energy cannons that look as if they shoot pure lightning. These energy weapons are able to pierce the strongest shields the Republic has left and cripple the ships they impact. Keep in mind, the Republic's been in a brutal conflict with the Crusaders and has very few large vessels remaining. Imperial scientists are optimistic the Imperial Battleship class or above can take multiple energy blasts before taking any real damage, but there is no way to be certain until we engage the Crusaders directly, which seems to be more and more inevitable as time passes on. Behind these weapons are a massive number of fighters or drones. Experts are not convinced these ships are piloted directly and could be automated, but the sheer number rivals that of the Imperial First Fleet's full TIE fighter complement. The Republic and the last remaining worlds of the Holy Mandate are in complete chaos. With the destruction of their primary fleets and the loss of the Holy Mandate's homeworld, the citizens of the Northwestern Rim are falling apart. Rampant riots and destruction at what they are calling the End Times have caused the Republic's military to be completely ineffective in defending their remaining worlds. Imperial security forces along with Alliance fleet have been dispatched to help solidify the area and keep this chaos from spreading beyond the Republic borders. The Imperial Navy has seen a 200% increase in recruitment rates over the last few months. It would seem the Empire's citizens would rather fight than riot. A massive ship construction effort has started. Shipyards from the core of the Empire, high above New Terra to the far reaches of the Western Rim, like the Kashyyyk system, are all producing the Emperor's latest war machines. If the Crusaders want to fight, they'll get one. The formation of Skull Squadron, a squadron of nothing but TIE fighter aces, has been approved. Congratulations to the latest ace pilots, Captain Weston, Lieutenant Doyle, Lieutenant Haggard, and Captain Midnight. Welcome to Skull Squadron. This wraps up tonight's netcast. Thank you for joining us this evening. I'm Captain Shaq with XPGIN. Join the Empire today for a better tomorrow. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Captain Shaq here, and welcome back to the Grand Campaign. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Who's sitting over New Terra Dry Docks right now? Um, the Imperial Fleet? What? The Federation Fleet? Yeah, I'm not president yet. Why are you just sitting here? Random Federation acclimator. Do we, I, I must have built you like a while ago and totally didn't notice. Because there's like another small fleet here too. Or maybe you guys are just getting repairs after fighting the Republic. Anyways, welcome back to the Grand Campaign. Uh, let's talk about what's going on here. So you may have noticed in that intro, it's a little bit shorter than average, and I kind of had to throw it together real quick. Uh, I am leaving day after tomorrow, and I'm in a mad rush right now to like get ready to head off to EA Play and then E3. So we've gone for seven days, uh, starting day after tomorrow. So I'm just happy that I'm going to be able to get this out today. I'm actually recording this the day you're watching it on release. So that's the kind of like crazy rush I've been in. Anyways, we've got the grand campaign going. The Empire. Um... You know, you guys in the in the comments have said multiple times that I should think about actually trying to take on the dimensional horror. And the only reason is the what we can learn from taking this thing down could be incredibly useful. Uh, some of you have said that because it's able to cross through dimensions, mostly, we might be able to use that technology to cross through dimensions and get across the universe faster and use it as some type of engine technology. Um, I'm debating on whether or not to go after it. And I think I might just do that because what I have noticed is the Crusaders, the second they started the war with the Republic, they were able to jump in like five fleets right where they needed them. Their engine technology is well beyond ours, just like all their other technology. Uh, first fleet has been upgraded, really. We're up to 175 on fleet power now. The Imperial fleet is just, every episode it's growing. Oh, we might be able to do this. And yes, all the bad puns that you guys dropped when you said, when I mentioned, yeah, I feel like we've got a chance now. You mean you've discovered a new hope? Like, oh, that was one of the top comments in the last video. <laughs> of a bad pun. Anyways, Recon Battle Group is still in Republic space and we are still at war. That war is not over yet. Uh, where are you guys actually located? You're here. We need to end this war as quickly as possible. Um, this is not what we should be focused on. What do we have? We've got a small invasion fleet of five ships. 
why don't we go ahead and hit this planet? We'll go ahead and unpause it. We'll tell the first recon group to hit this planet, bombard it, blockade it, and maybe even invade it, though we've only got a handful of Hostile uh, fleet ahead and interorbit, so we're not caught out of position. Hostile fleet engaged. Oh, are you talking about the space station right here? Come on, boys. That's so unnecessary. Captain Demo Dan. And that's our new ships, actually. Now, I didn't have time to go in and name all the newest vessels that have joined the fleet. I plan on doing that in the next episode once I'm back. Next week, there probably won't be a Stellaris episode, or even two, uh, sadly. So let's go ahead and start bombarding this planet, boys. Get on over here. Wow, what did they just hit? They just knocked up to 96%. They must have won a fairly large battle. I just like this battle to be over with. I do not need to be fighting the Republic. I mean, I don't mind them grabbing territory up here. The more territory we have is kind of our only advantage. <sighs> so we did pick up, where's our construction ship? We did pick up a bunch of territory. Uh, we colonized Taurus. We we actually terraformed it and renamed it Taurus. That's the name that I chose out of the subscription, out of the, uh, the description from the last episode. Uh, and we've got a lot of other planets here that we might be able to terraform. All right, go ahead and build those. Do we pick up anything else? We might have. No, we didn't. Close though, very close. Yump. What's this construction ship? Revan. Yeah, Revan, you're already on it. Good. Perfect. So yeah, we picked up a little bit of territory. One of our research. Uh, we are, whoa, we need to pause. We are over our planetary cap by one planet. What colony just got finished? It's you. So, Terra's Prime, which I think was the planet down here in the south, wasn't it? Yeah, here it is, Terra's Prime. Allowed us to grab these last planets. Um, I'm gonna add you, because you're not a very large planet anyways, to one of the other sectors that we've already got operational, probably the Husko sector. Uh, let's scroll down to our sector management. Husko sector, there you are. Let's go ahead and give you control of these worlds. I don't wanna micromanage these, especially not these small ones. I'm actually gonna give you a number of worlds over here. That puts us down to seven. Do we wanna give them Taurus? What was Husko? What kind of world were you? Uh, I can actually click it right here. Management, you were a energy. No, you were a balanced one. Really, balanced? All right, I'm gonna leave it as balanced then. But I'm not gonna give you any more worlds. And I want to control the development of Taurus myself because that world is just so large, so. Cool, we're back in the positives. Taurus is a massive planet. This used to be one of the tomb worlds. I know, you're all incredibly unhappy. Maybe it's because you moved to a planet that didn't have the farming capabilities to keep you alive. Now, I love what you guys were talking about, the newest update. I haven't done any research on it yet, but it sounds like we're gonna be able to have centralized production planets. So we're gonna be able to move food from one planet to another, which is something I really wanted to see. I wanted agricultural worlds, where you know, this planet is a huge, ball of green beautifulness and I want it to grow all of my food and then spread that out to like the city based almost Coruscant like planets. I think that would be great. Uh, Taurus though, you guys get so uppity. As soon as we take a planet, you all move there and all immediately find out there's no food. Uh, we're gonna fix this though, we're gonna fix this. Let's just get you build. Uh, no, what the hell did I just click? We don't need a frontier clinic, we need Farms. Spaceport should be building the hydroponics bay. Good. Oh, we're minus 12. We gotta build more. Uh, we need to upgrade the actual... Can I not upgrade you yet? Plenty of people. Oh, it's already queued for upgrade. As soon as this upgrades, we can upgrade all of our farms here. So, what do we got? The planet is... Oh, the, it's over. It is over. Let's check out the map real quick. The map has changed. Oh boy, not in the way we were thinking. Yeah, we have won the following demands. Liberated a planet. Uh, I'm guessing that would be in here. There's a new empire now. We have humiliated a group. I assume it was the Holy Mandate and then they have seceded three other planets. Where did they secede these planets from? Who gained control of these worlds? Interesting. 
All right, we'll unpause it. Uh, the Crusaders, though, should still be at war with the Holy Mandate. I have a feeling, and you can see them right here, the Holy Mandate is not long for this world. They're going to be eliminated relatively soon. And the Jeskanians have stopped, uh, stopped guaranteeing the independence of the, yeah. Wait, the Jeskanians stopped giving, what? Of who? I, I need to look at that again. I didn't see that. You guys? No, that was the League. Who did you just drop? The Wasari? No, because they're part of, you're, they're a, um, definitely not them. You guys. Who the hell are you guys? Offer association status, and they've got a white piece. So this is the new group. They used to be a Republic planet, and now they're in neutral. And they share a system with another Republic, like small, very small planet, or almost like a moon out here. So they're a moon, oh man. Kinda cool. Well, why don't we make contact with you? How about we offer you, uh, I can't do any of this, because you hate it, but I can give you offer association status and get you kind of building up a positive reputation with us, and then maybe we can bring you into the fold. Uh, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna offer you an association status, and then we'll start increasing how much you like us. So, the offer is out. This may put us into a war if we actually bring them into the fold, because they're so close to Crusader space, especially closer to their, like, their core worlds. Uh, they accept it? Yep, they accepted it. Cool beans. How long until we can actually, like, bring you in? Probably gonna be a bit. Plus 20. God, they don't like the whole xenophobe. The xenophobe thing. I mean, come on, we're an empire, but we're an empire made of many different species now. You'd think we'd be over the whole xenophobia thing. Apparently not. Alien races have to prove themselves before they can join the empire. And that's why... Oh, what do we got here? Yeah, go ahead and research that. And that's why uh, the Predators are now fighting for us, which is pretty awesome. All right, based on your guys' advice and the idea of having better technology, I think we're gonna go after the Dimensional Horror and we're gonna hit it with the entire Federation fleet. And I'm feeling pretty good about it. The other thing we'll get out of this is a little bit more experience for Admiral Howler. So I'm giving the order. The fleet is going to move up there. The fleet feels Imperial Command wants to know how well the Empire's fleet can actually hold up against uh, a larger enemy without going to war directly with the Crusaders. So that's what we're gonna do. Construction also, complete. while they're en route, going to fix a minor issue that I I created. When I build, we go all the way down to the bottom. Okay, not the bottom. TIE Bomber. There were no weapons on our TIE Bombers, so. Let's attach them. Wait a minute, where's the hell's TIE Bomber weapons? There you are. TIE Bomber, TIE Bomber, what weapon's better? 8 to 12, 16 to 20, okay. There you go. Uh, I can give you a hyperdrive, a wormhole drive, or a warp drive. Interesting. You just get whatever one you want. There you go, you've been upgraded. What do we have here? Rivalry has been declared by the Alvari Collective and the Sovereign of Mablar. Is that what you're called? No. Sovereign Domains. And how are they doing back here? You hate us, don't you? No, you don't hate us. You're, you're part of, you're protectorate of us. I'd like to integrate you. I can't do it yet. If we release them, I'm gonna release them and see what happens. Cause this is gonna take forever. They've got to get a certain amount of our technology, uh, which is completely pathetic on their side. Like, let's say their technology, far inferior to ours. Let's release the subject, confirm. Demand vassalization, demand tribute. Um. Demand vassalization, what happened here? What was that? Very well, we agree to become, if you agree to defend us from the horrors of the galaxy, good, good. That means I'll be able to integrate them now in 3,600 3, days, perfect. And what is all this shenanigans? Let's pause this real quick. 
Okay, non-aggression pact has been signed with the Exacto Dominion. Just the tiny worlds are trying to come together, it looks like. It's not gonna happen, guys. It's not gonna matter. And they're gonna be part of our empire now. Good, so we're gonna grab all of this territory. Fantastic. I wonder if we can do the same thing here. Because we're not gonna be able to bring them in because their technology is crap. Because right now they're a protectorate. If I release the subject, let's just try it. Release subject, demand vassalization. Accept it. Oh, let's not pause. Give it a second. I want these guys in the Empire so bad. The Bill Knox are just adorable. Hostile fleet engaged. Whoa! Hostile fleet engaged. Why are we at war? What is happening? Uh, have declared war on the Valerie Collective, which means that we have now gone to war with the Crusaders. Oh shit! And one of our sh one of our fleets must be in in the area. What do we've got? Crap. We've got to get the Republic out of there. What's their biggest fleet here? There's a 50k fleet. I can't order the retreat. Why is there a 30 day count counter on jumping out of this fight? Oh no, Admiral Ortega is screwed. So screwed. We've lost, I mean, they've got 50,000 versus our battle group of 3,000. They're, they're so done. We're now at war with the Crusaders. Are there any other combat? Well, we've got to pull the fleet back. Come back here, First Fleet. They may jump to us at any moment. They've gone to war with us, because they've, what they've done is they've gone to war with the Avari Collective, uh, which would be Valdari Confederacy. Is that who they went to war with directly? No, they went with the, uh, the Collective, so they're actually at war with these guys, but they're part of the Federation, so now we're at war. We are full on at war. Oh, crap. Do we have control? And we don't have control over the Federation fleet yet. Oh, shit just got real. Damn it. All right, let's clear some of this out. Oh, where, what are, what's the Jeskanian fleet? A 14K fleet and a 13K fleet are located here. Okay, not huge, but it's something at least. I don't imagine that'll last very long. Uh, we've got... Another 5k fleet here from the Wasari. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. All right, well, the Republic, sadly, we're gonna lose the recon fleet. We weren't ready for this. I mean, I should have pulled them back anyways once this battle was over, but I didn't even think about it, here goes. The recon fleet, one of our old battle cruisers. We've lost the recon fleet, it's dead. Now the question is where are they gonna go? We also lost our Admiral. He died in that battle. 50k, so we need to watch where they go. Chances are they're not gonna hit us first. And I'm betting our allies are going to go after these planets. So here's, we gotta figure out what we're gonna hit first. Shit. Where would they hit first? If I was them, I would go after this world because that's what's gonna happen with the Elvari. The Elvari are gonna go after them on this planet. Where are our ground troops? Our largest ground troops. Oh shit, enemy territory right now. All right, I need you to come here, and then here, and then head back. Where are you located? Oh, right in the middle of the Republic. I need you to beeline it here, if you can. It's kind of skirting close to the, to the, uh, the Crusader faction. We're gonna try for an invasion right here. What's the war score? Like, what are you asking for? It's just, what do you want for this war? I didn't actually look at it. Fleet combat stats. Yeah, we caused no casualties. We lost our entire fleet. We also need to get the all of our planets building ships. Uh, right now, we need to get full on production. Spaceport, New Terra. I need you to build us some, we talked about building smaller ships. Uh, the Vigil class would probably be the smallest ship that I can build right now. Let's build a bunch of Vigils. Uh, if you're wondering what the Vigil is, it's actually a point defense ship. So, ship designer. Let me check the Vigil real quick and see what she's armed with before we build like 20 of them. I also want to build some Imperial carriers as well. Uh, Vigil, 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 Vigil. I passed you, didn't I? 
the good news is, relatively soon, I should be picking up command. Uh, there she is, visual escort. Yeah, point defense. Don't we have tier three point defense? We do have tier three point defense. You did an auto upgrade. Yeah, upgrade the design. There's the new vigil class. Uh, let's build a bunch of those. So lots of point defense to take out those fighters that they're building. Uh, but we're not having any time to waste. We're gonna have, go ahead and send up the first fleet. Because what they're gonna do is, if they attacked us here, I'm thinking this is the closest planet they have that we can get to that's not in the middle of their force. I wanna see if we can kill whatever force they jump in here to take us on. Hopefully it's not their entire fleet. I'm hoping the rest of their fleet is like too busy fighting. Um, I don't know, groups like this. Damn, where's the Imperial fleet? Right, let's go ahead and unpause this. The fleets are moving out. The ground troops are moving out. I need to train more ground troops. Let's pick up some armies at Imperial's Landing. No, who's got, yeah, there we go. Predators, give me some predators. Good stuff. I don't wanna look at those combat stats. Oh shit, it's just got real bad real fast. We were gonna take on the horror. I didn't think they'd hit us. I thought they'd keep going up to the Holy Mandate and actually finish them off. Here's some of our ground troops moving through. I'm trying to keep an eye on where their enemy forces are. They've got ground invasion forces to the north. They actually own a couple of planets up here. What's the biggest fleet that you've got? You got an 8K, that's worthless. A 700, you need to be bringing these guys together. You really do. How long till we have command of the Federation fleet? 2428, in one year. So if the Federation fleet can just survive for one year, we can dump a ton of resources into its construction. Um, now I know I'm taking a huge chance here. I'm moving the fleet away. Actually, let's pick up a bunch of fighters real quick. They'll build really fast. I'm moving the fleet away from our front line for good reason. We've got a hostile fleet presence. Where at? Federation fleet has arrived. Oh man, you guys, I, don't fight this. You can't win this. I haven't buffed this fleet up enough yet. Tell me you're just jumping through. Tell me you're just jumping through. I need one more year and I'll have command of the fleet. They jumped out, where are they going? They're running, but they're not gonna run fast enough. Their engines are better. Where did the Federation fleet go? Two enemy fleets here. Federation fleet has engaged uh, a couple of, oh, they've engaged one of their, their battleships. Hell yeah, now there you go. Now get the hell out of there. Don't wait around, they're not waiting, good. Yeah, fight the fights that you can win. Just give me command of that fleet. I wanna, I wanna get them back to the Federation, or Imperial space, and I wanna get them upgraded. Um, yeah, we're gonna try to invade this world, I think, and capture it. That'll give us a buff on war score. And then, I don't know, maybe bring the Federation fleet in there as well and hold, and then see what they throw at us. And then maybe we can invade coming in from the north and push this war in our favor. Uh, what can we negotiate for a... Oh, here's how we can find out what they want. So they want a couple of planets. Oh, sweet babies. They don't want a couple of planets. They want all the planets. Look at the war requirements they want. They want everything. They want one of mine? Oh, you could kiss my ass. I can ask them to secede planets to us if we can push this in our favor and ask for a white piece. That might be worth it. We could secure the world up here inside the Alvari Collective territory. And then maybe we could ask for like these two worlds in the Republic space, uh, or push back the Crusader worlds here. Zack and Helam. All right, let's keep, keep time moving forward. Let's build up a few more ships. I'm thinking some more hangar ships, possibly. Or we should save up our minerals and get ready to upgrade the Federation fleet, which I, oh no. You guys, you guys are engaging them, aren't you? You don't have a chance, run. Good, they're running. They're actually playing this fairly smart. Every time I look, they're running away. There's the Federation fleet currently in, attacked by what? 
and pause. No, they're moving out. A couple of Crusader transports are being attacked by something. There's just so many of us, that might be our one advantage. Uh, who is this? Fleet combat going on. Who's engaging what? Oh, look at you guys! Who is this, the Wasari? No, the Zimmerpunk League. It's not, they don't have a huge fleet, but look at them. Tell me you're going to take out their resources in that system. Oh, shit. That's the problem. They've got these big fleets and they can get them just about anywhere. Where are we? Two more jumps till we make it there. What about ground troops? We've got small force right here bombarding a world right now. Oh, because the Crusaders have invaded this world and we're bombing the hell out of it. That's pretty funny, actually. We might be able to push them out of there if we had ground troops in the zone. Where can we get ground troops from? Um, this is one of those armies that I have that's a leftover from one of the Kashyyyk system, from one of the old empires. If we can, why don't we get a bunch of, what do you got, just defense force? Yeah, give me a handful, and one robotic army as well. Give me some ground troops. We're gonna bring them over there if possible and actually invade that group and push them out. That'll be one more small victory for us. We're minus one right now. I don't see any enemy locations here, but they can probably just jump right on top of us. What is this? The ground transports are almost there. Fantastic. We get there, we bombard, we invade. Maybe we can we can declare a white piece and grab a little bit of territory. This is gonna get crazy. Hostile fleet engaged. Okay, pause. What do we got? Hostile fleet is engaged. Our, all right, our battle group has arrived in the Fevalion system. Let's go ahead and bombard it. Take out the space station while we have the obvious advantage before their reinforcements get here. Let's get our ground troops en route to this area. There they are right there. All transports. Just jump straight here. I'm hoping their fleets are too busy or too far away to get here in time. Come on, boys, don't wait for the invitation. Get in there and take that planet. I wonder if I could like sneak take a couple of planets and then maybe declare a white piece. What is this? Oh, rival decorations and active buildings, it's fine. Taurus should still be building up surface. Uh, yeah, let's get some more farms. Oh, I heard that, something just hyperspaced in. There they are. Transports are here. All right, go ahead and enter orbit. Why are you guys moving so slow? The first shots against the Crusaders have gone out. No, no, no. No, 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 no. You need to get over there. We need to get over there. We lost a couple of bombers and a destroyer in that fight. You've got to be kidding me. Begin bombardment. I wish it would tell us the status of the Federation fleet. I, as soon as they get caught, we're gonna be in trouble. Where are they at now? Oh man, I wish I could have them in one location. Whoa, we have a single Venator over here. Random. We actually lost ships in that battle. Initiating sake for mercy. Wait a minute. If we just took out their one of their stations, then this should have their technology in it, right? And then we'll be able to research it as soon as we have a piece of it. Science ship. I don't care what you're doing right now. Nothing matters like researching this. Get over here. If we can get a, just a piece of their technology, maybe we can start researching it. Start bombarding the world. We're bombarding a Crusader home world, or a Crusader world. And we're gonna liberate the Valrathi. Not Valrathi, not Valrathi. The Dominion worlds here, right? No, it's collective. All right, let's see what we've got. We've got a Husko squadron is currently engaging their transports. Oh, no, they're screwed. <laughs> they're screwed. Uh, and they've also got three massive fleets there, so that's interesting. And they're jumping. Where are you guys jumping to? Oh, they're just winding down. 
So they've got three fleets right there. Pretty good distance away. I might have enough time to take this planet. You guys could bombard it a little faster. That would be great. We might not have enough ground troops to take this. Where's that second invasion fleet? Orbit, how far away are you? Oh, oh, right through Crusader. Yeah, no, <laughs> it's not happening. Go this way. Now I'm a little worried. We don't have the uh, the ground troops necessary for this. 2K fleet moving out. What's this? Three major fleets are engaging the. Ah, oh, shit. They haven't engaged yet. It's a 14K fleet. Just run. Just run. Did they come in here and kill all of their... No. Yeah, maybe they did. There's no mines there. I'm assuming they killed everything. Go, Juskanian! Take out their resources. Distract the enemy fleets. We're going to invade one of their worlds. What in the world is this? A 50k fleet has just jumped on top of one of the Juskanian's 14ks. Oh, shit. Well, there goes one fleet. Are you guys even scratching them? You almost took their shields down. Good job. Oh, they just got reinforcements. They're so screwed. Scientist is granted trait. Good for her. Spark of genius. She's getting, she's getting wrecked. And I went all the way north to try to capture this, and now I'm not going to be able to invade it. Can we take this? Let's see. Begin the invasion. Let's see how they do. We've taken out their fortifications, uh, and our units are actually stronger than the majority of theirs. So we'll see what happens. Oh, I can always retreat. What do you mean we own no armies on the surface of this planet? Okay, we can hit retreat if we need to. Uh, we are not gonna win this. Go ahead and retreat. Damn. Situation Keep bombarding updated. it at least. We'll wait for the reinforcements to get there. We'll be able to take it once they get there. And they should be healing over time. They are. Perfect. Uh, it's gonna be a couple of jumps. And here comes all of all those, uh, Thai bombers coming up. I need to bring you guys into a different squadron, actually. Approaching the outer rim, a strange subspace echo has been detected in the galactic, uh, detected in intergalactic space, and are now approaching the outer rim of our galaxy. Several smaller contacts appear to be racing ahead of the main body of echoes toward a number of rim systems. We have entered the position of these systems into the situation log. They are almost upon us. Situation log updated. Let's pause real quick. I'm so focused on fighting these guys that I forgot about this weird echo we've got coming in. The coming storm, breach points, track on map. Ah, shit. Oh, shit. Everything's happening at once. Oh, crap. This is not good. How's the Federation fleet doing? It's still alive and it still has 58,000. That's good. Uh, they've got a couple of other fleets, but they're kind of all over the place. This is not... Oh, shit. I wonder how strong they're going to be. Okay, well, focus on the fight we've got ahead of us now. We'll deal with this when the time comes. There's not a whole lot we can do about it. Um, why don't we make you a beacon? Let's start filling out a secondary fleet. Everybody's going too damn far away. Trying to reinforce the main fleet. Beg for mercy. What I really need right now... New Terra, what are you building? Is those ground troops to get up here. Gotta fight the battles we can win. Give me a few victory classes. Subspace signal. We are picking up a strong subspace signal washing over the galaxy. At points of origin appear to be uh, contacts approaching from intergalactic space. Establish a visual feed. Whoa. What the shit? Did 
its giant eyeball. Translation fail. Main screen off. What was that? We've got sensor contact with three of these systems. Station under attack. The first wave. We've received word that several outlying systems along the Galactic Rim are being overrun by some sort of invasion force. This appears to have been the source of the subspace echoes we detected approaching our galaxy. What we are encountering now is only the Vanguard. The main body of contacts is yet to arrive. Reports so far have been confused, but the ships, in quotations, used by the invaders appear organic in nature and do not respond to hails. Our entire galaxy may be facing an invasion of unprecedented scope. Brief the fleet commanders. Ends the coming storm chain, begins the scourge, avoid event chain. Oh shit. Hostile fleet present, where? Bengongi, one of the former predator worlds, are under attack. Oh, uh, what the hell? These fleets aren't all that big, but what are you? They are like crazy alien looking space squids. Okay, it's like a small invasion force. What do you have going on here? 4K fleets? Weird. They're hitting us. More ships are incoming. And the primary force is too far away. We can't stop this. And they may have more coming in. We've gotta get down there and we've gotta stop this invasion. Something from another dimension has arrived. Damn it. Um, shit, okay. We have a fighting force, a 4K fighting force to the north. We're going to send you guys south. I need the, I need the Federation fleet. I need that damn Federation fleet so bad. Now these guys should be hostile to everyone, right? They're taking out mining stations right now. Do we have any defenses in this area? Yes, but they're not strong enough to stop something like this. Uh, and our construction ships are probably too far away to do anything. <sighs> Damn. It's probably the only sector that might be able to slow something like that down. The third fleet is a, sec a single Venator-class battleship. Where are you located? You're way out there, right? Yeah. Head on over to the Kashyyyk system. Skull Squadron, I want you at the Kashyyyk system. Where are you right now? All right, I want all of you guys that are currently running north Rendezvous here. All of our fighter squadrons one day rendezvous here that have been building. Get over here. If you can manage it. I know you're probably going through hostile territory to do this. You are, you jackasses. There. Now go to Kashyyyk. There we go. Oh, I can hold shift and select all you guys? All of you, report to this world, and then head over to Kashyyyk as quickly as possible. Except for you, you're my Venator. You're my only like capital ship. I want you to take the kind of roundabout way. You've got to get here safely. We need a fighting force. Damn, talk about shitty timing. Uh, now, one of the things that we can do, we have a few worlds that are in the area, like the Polaris system here. You build me. Actually, you space station. You're going to be a rally point right here. Build me uh, some gladiators and acclimators. I need some more cash. We can trade for that cash. It's like that mad rush to defend ourselves. Um, this is where the game gets exciting. Let's see what we've got here. There should be a trade center actually in the south. No, right here. Yeah, there we go. Let's make contact with you guys. It's been a while since we've been in a war where we needed you, but I need to trade for minerals. I'd like to buy some minerals. Thank you very much. Okay, the world's in our area. Polaris, you're going to be building a few ships. Some victory acclimators and some ISDs. We need some ISDs down there. You're already building three ships. That should be fine. Kashyyyk, no, Clip Clip. You've got a space station. Let's get you building 
can't afford Benedict's ISDs. They're too expensive right now. Alright, then give me a battle cruiser. Reinforcements are in route. Situation Where's those ground troops? Updated. Station under attack. Station under attack. Yeah, my station's back there under attack. That's fine. How's the ground troops doing? You guys healed up? You are healed up. Where is our second invasion force? You're not here yet. Good, you're researching that technology. Um, damn, you gotta be kidding me. You're that many jumps Station out? Station under attack. Alright, those ground troops are on the way back. Station under attack. Head back here. How strong are their forces now? 8k, 4k. They are building up really, really fast. We, God, we can't wait around for this. <sighs> the Crusaders actually started... We're winning the war! What? I mean... Yeah, because we're blockading a single world. We're actually winning the war by 4%. I got real excited there. I know it's not by much. Just the fact that we are, even for a short amount of time. I'll take what I can get. Alright, are we in command of the fleet yet? Uh, 2428... Uh, December. In December, we'll have command of the Alliance Fleet. Station the Alliance Fleet is doing an immediate U-turn and is going to fight this invasion force. How many more of these are there coming in? Are there more... Swarmers coming in? Seven ships incoming, but they might be just rallying their force here. If we can get there fast enough. Damn, I wish I had control of the Federation Fleet. A few more months. That would be perfect. I could send them down here, put a stop to this invasion force from this random Hostile dim. Fleet engaged. What do we got? Bangongi is invaded by these gorgers, these eyeball monsters. There's not a whole lot we can do right Station now. Under attack. The second wave. We are never able to discern the main body of approaching subspace echoes from our own galaxy's background radius, which can only mean one thing. They have arrived. If the size of the vanguard is any indication, the main hostile fleet and invaders must be massive. They are here. How big are we talking? Okay. It's in the 30,000s. Multiple fleets of 30,000s. 30,000. 30, hostile fleet engaged. 8,000, 4,000. Shit, we need the main force here. 27,000. 62,000. Oh, no way. And they brought colony ships as well. The damn Zerg. We are so screwed. There's an 80,000 fleet down there. This is now priority. Station under attack. Hostile we have to pull detected. back everything. Station under attack. We have to pull back everything and prepare for combat. Bring back the main fleet. Run. Get back there. For mercy. Crusaders are no longer the greatest threat in the galaxy. Still want to invade this planet, though. Damn it. I don't have time to fight both of you. This is crazy. Oh, we've been building up for the Crusaders, Station and now we're fighting two different empires. They're spreading, too. We've got to stop them here. I wonder if their technology... If we could possibly win this? Whoa. How big of a fleet? 27, 31, 27, 4. We could win that fight. What's our technology like? Oh, we can't look. You are the most disgusting life form we've ever encountered. Run back to whichever galaxy you crawled out of. Damn it. We need to smack them down. They're actually invading some of our planets and trying to get a foothold, and we can't allow that. Um, are you. Where are you at? Are you actually fighting Crusader forces right now? I mean, I love where your head's at, and if you win, awesome, but you need to go. Come on, take that space station out. You've got this. Station under attack. Damn. Where are those damn ground troops? First Imperial Fleet. Uh, ground troops of the second army. I want to get you invading this Crusader planet before we leave. Where are you? Uh, armies, there you are. You're two jumps away. Good. Primary fleet, you guys are all on the move. Yeah, you're all heading to Kashyyyk, it's perfect. We're moving as well. 
And then in December, I should command the Federation fleet, meaning we can hit you with both of them if we can just win these battles and fall back. We'll be looking pretty good. Construction vessel. Construction vessel, where are you? Come here. We need to stall them. Get over here, build a military station. Give me the... Uh, oh, shit. I gotta actually check that, because you guys were saying I messed up on the design for the damp fortress. Uh, so for our defense fortress, you got swapped out, didn't you? Yeah, subspace, no. You were supposed to be subspace... Shield dampening. You're supposed to be shield dampening. Yes, there we go. Construction ship, get over here. Build military station, give me the dampening fortresses. Um, like here, maybe? Oh, broke. That's not actually gonna work. Just move here? Now build a military station. Give me one right there. Take the advantages we can get, right? Check our research. Ah, it's taking a while. All right, unpause it. Station under attack. We're gonna hit them, and then we're gonna pull back as soon as Situation the first fleet gets here. Updated. Situation log updated. What? The mad rush to figure this out. Um, situation log. Here we go. The Finn Habis system was the political, administrative, and economic center for the ancient First Lake. Okay, that's fine. Can't do anything with it, though, because it's bugged. The Scourge. Our galaxy has been invaded by a ravenous swarm of spacefaring creatures that seem intent on consuming all life in their path. The rampage of these Batherian invaders must be stopped before their numbers overwhelm us. Uh, zero infested worlds. Vessels consumed by the Scourge 10. Is this how we stop them? They literally are like the Zerg. Holy crap. The first fleet is en route. It's going to be a while. They've got quite a few jumps. Uh, our invasion force, though, should be arriving. Station under attack. Here shortly. Hurry up. Make the jump. I really want to invade this planet. Situation. Oh, updated. thank you. Hostile fleet. They tried to build a space station. Station under attack. Station's under attack. Station's under attack. Yeah, I know. We're working on it. Station under place. attack. We need the primary one. So they're kind of just expanding from this corner. Without our main fleet, you're not going to be able to do anything. Station it's almost December. Is the Federation fleet still alive? It is. But they're badly damaged. Damn. They must have gotten invaded some world somewhere and then fell back. Hostile fleet engaged. Hostile fleet engaged. Where? Oh, Station right. under attack. Station under attack. I know. I know. They're spreading like the plague. We're gonna hit them as soon as we can. Now they should be able to rebuild their ships. As long as they don't take a world. Station Damn, under we need to go attack. faster. Construction complete. Station under attack. They're building a space station. Oh, they've gotten reinforcements. The Crusaders have arrived. All right, ground troops, you guys gotta go. Come back. Come back here. We're gonna have to focus all of our efforts on invading and taking out the, uh, the Zerg swarm. So... Let's get both of our armies. Ground transports. Head over to Kashyyyk. That's the rally point for the invasion force. Let's get all of our transports over here. New Terra. I want you to embark all ground troops. Prepare for combat. Everybody's over on Kashyyyk. Don't, don't go through enemy territory. Let's get them... Here. All right, they're en route. She's got ground troops as well. Now, first fleet, unpause it. Where are you guys at? Station under attack. Slowly on your way. It's probably because you've got Tie Hostile Fighters in part of your fleet again. Yeah, you do. That's probably slowing you down. So let's go ahead and not move. We want to all the way back up to the top. Pull you out of the fleet. So we want to create a new fleet. Scroll all the way down, find our TIE Fighters, remove them, because they're using the old engines, or their weird TIE Fighter-only engines, which is slowing us. Um, oh man, I have no idea where you're at in this list, so let's find them. 
I'm wondering if somehow we can pull off a victory against this invasion force. Can we get some technology out of it? They could be useful to stop the Crusaders. So I still find there's a sliver of hope. Also, we now have control over the Federation fleet. So we'll be able to hit this Zerg invasion. That's what I'm going to call them from now on. Uh, the, the Zerg invasion force. Oh, why do you scroll all the way up like that? Now I've got to find that other TIE fighter. Um, if we hit them hard enough, maybe we can... Maybe there's a way to win this. And then get some technology that could rival that of the Crusaders. I don't even know if we got that research done. Uh, looking over the corpse of that space station. Carriers, carriers, ISDs. There's so many ships. Uh, if only this was just a little bit better organized. All right, I got him out of the fleet. Let's see if that makes a difference. It should. Uh, let's see. First Imperial Fleet, cancel. I just want to select you. I need you moving. That didn't actually change the time Station frame. Under attack. Damn. Get out of there. Evacuate the area. They're attacking us on like every front. Just right here is 117,000 fleet. 36,000. The only hope we have is if I can hit one of these fleets, kill it, and back off. Repair, hit it again. Get the Alliance fleet there as well. Speaking of Alliance fleet. Oh, what the hell happened to you guys? No way, that's not the Federation fleet, right? No? What are you doing and where are you? I can't seem to center on you. You're telling me the Federation fleet right before I got command lost its entire combat capability? Military power, 12,000. Yes, that's exactly what happened. And I don't even know where you guys are. I can't seem to give you orders. Missing in action. They lost a battle someplace. Damn it. Hostile fleet detected. Oh, we are so screwed. <laughs> where are you? You're almost here. And we're building more and more troops. They're all rallying here. Good. All of you should be one big fleet. Merge. Form up. Just to organize this. Just merge the fleets together, please. 3K fleet. That's what we've got to deal with. Get within the space stations. Also, yeah, you guys are the rally point. Excellent. So we're minus six now on the war with the Crusaders. So the Crusader battle started. All of our allies engaged them. Station under attack. Are currently engaging them. So it leaves us to stop this. Why did it have to be in our territory? Why couldn't it have been like over here or something? Oh, shit. How unlucky can you be? How good it would have been if they hit the Crusaders? Oh well. Can't Station be helped now. Under attack. Station under attack. I need you down here. Hurry up. Go pause it. Go faster. Station under attack. So we're gonna hit the fleet that's right here. That's gonna be our goal. And then we're gonna fall back. We're gonna hit him and we're gonna fall Hostile back. Hostile fleet engaged. Station under attack. I know, I know. We've got hostile fleets present in a number of different systems. I'm just hoping they're not smart enough to rally their troops into one position. So, one more jump and we'll be engaging Zerg forces. Uh, the, the swarm here. There is a 36k fleet. There's actually a 52k fleet. They've actually formed up together. Hopefully, our technology isn't completely worthless against them. We'll be jumping in four days. If we can catch them off guard, we can fall back and do some repairs. Come on, come on. Swarmlings. There we go, we've jumped. We'll have sensor contact a moment. We have sensor contact, we are engaging the fleet. Fight them, damn it. Where do they jump to? Oh, 
I don't want to jump too deep into their territory. These are colony ships. Change course. Take out the colony ships. See if we can stop them. I wonder if they've taken any worlds yet. Hostile fleet detected. I'm changing your course. Go this way. Two days, one. I need to take out Evading one of their combat hostile fleets. fleet. Here we go. There's a 62k fleet. Engage it. The dreadnoughts with the fleet. Oh, Alright, the battle has begun. Our first fight with, surprisingly, the Zerg Swarm, this new race that's coming in. And they're shooting some kind of, like, spores at us. That seems terrible. Does point defense work against that? Station under attack. It would seem not. No, it would seem not. Damn it. All right, well, let's see what happens. So we've got a 176k fleet. The enemy's coming in. Station um, doubt they're doing some serious damage to that victory class. Who is that? O'Hare? Looks like we got reinforcements followed us in. Hostile fleet engaged. Fair enough. Take out the swarm. We're still at 175. We've lost a ship falling back as soon as we win this. If we win this. We should win this. They've Post colonized the world? Engaged. That's not good. 60k. Come on, boys. Win this battle. Hostile fleet engaged. Check the map real quick. There's a 68k fleet behind us right now. Look, they've taken planets. Station under attack. Oh, they're trying to colonize this world as well. One of our worlds. It's kind of funny that they came through here. This is the territory of the Alam? Alim? The, the group that was trying to wipe out all life in the universe. This is their world. So that's actually one of their planets. Uh, all right, anyways, back to the fight. Station All right, we basically just completely wrecked the 60k fleet. Uh, if their last hive ships, or whatever you want to call these things, would die, we'll fall back and get repairs, prepare for the another for the next engagement. We don't want to fight one of these fleets with... Uh, he's gained cautious. All right, good. You won the battle. Well done. Get out of there. They've also gotten a larger fleet strength now. So, go find repairs. Uh, Scarif is the nearest world for repairs. That'll be fine. Uh, Revan is actually reinforcing that area. Good. How's the fleets doing over here? Get, up, get merged together, all of you. Come on, merge everything. Station under attack. I need to know that you ships are ready for combat. Hey, that, that Venator arrived from all the way over in Crusader space. Who is that? Did you fall back? You Station did. Under attack. Now, can they build more ships? That's what I'm worried about. We're gonna minimize our planets. Rally points, factions. We don't need all this stuff. What we do need is our ground armies. I need you at Liara. Form up here. Actually, farm up one jump away. You, Research form up there. Hostile fleet detected. Hostile fleet's moving. I wanna hit them again. How long will it take to repair and upgrade you? How, many, how much damage did we take? Oh, yeah, a couple of our Quintons took some serious damage. Some of our research is done. We got new warp drives. Fantastic. 5% to energy, quantum destabilizers. Uh, what does this do? Quantum destabilizer. Agitate the local quantum field, disrupting sensitive target equipment. No. Capacitor fields, lightning clouds. Cloud lightning, what kind of weapon damage do you do? One to 27 damage. Ignores armor. Did this come off of the Crusaders? I don't think it did. I think we had this already, but I could be wrong. One to 27 damage with a range of 50. I'd have to see what we're already doing. That doesn't, isn't that hard actually? Ship design. Uh, our medium weapons, if I click one of these, and I look at our medium energy weapons that we use. 
Okay, what we're using already is better. So, auto upgrade these designs. New research is completed. Let's pick up the capacitor fields. What do you do? Shield regeneration update. Wow. That's kind of cool. Could be good for the in-between fights. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take the, um, the capacitor field research. Should be good. All right. You in position starting to repair first fleet? No, you're not. You're working on it. Hurry up. We've got to repair. The war against the Crusaders is not faring too well. Though we are getting a lot of experience for our Admiral, which is kind of nice. Skull Squadron has upgraded the fleet up to 8,000 now. We should probably get the rest of our combat groups, anybody that we've got over at the Kashyyyk system. Uh, join up with the Clip Clip 17th Fleet. Get over here. Um, third Fleet. Get over here. I don't care if you're a Federation fleet. Just get over here. Skull Squadron, you should already be there. Oh, you're not. You're at the key ship. Yeah, let's go to Clip Clip. Skull is in route, and we'll get you guys joined up together. Oh, we need you at like 30,000 would be nice. Yeah, Federation fleet's worthless. Uh, okay, you should be repairing. Being repaired. 99% complete. Excellent. A couple of ships, like Haven's Daybreak and the Santa Fe, are being repaired. Construction complete. Gonna upgrade the design as well. 